Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to Chucking from Scratch with David McGill. And in today's video, I'm going to break down eight positions that new trucking business owners need to fill within their company. What's up everybody? Welcome back to the Scratch with David McGill. Now, before I get started, I know a lot of y'all may notice a change in my personal appearance. And I wasn't going to say anything at all at first, but I figured I might as well just keep it real with y'all. Like the truth is, I really just got tired of the old ones. I had them for so long and they just had to go. So I finally just pulled the trigger and went ahead and bought some new glasses. Now that we got that out of the way, let's talk about the eight positions. The first position on my list is the most obvious, but you got to have a driver. Now, if you're an owner operator, then you'll fill that driving position yourself. Now, if you're going to be an owner non-operator, you'll need to hire a driver. Now, the second position on my list is the dispatcher role. Now you can either dispatch yourself or you can hire a dispatching service. Now in a later video, I'll explain which of those options I recommend for new trucking business owners. Now position number three is a factoring company. In a nutshell, factoring companies will pay you within like one or two days of you delivering a load for a fee, of course. Now factoring companies aren't mandatory, but most new trucking companies need them when they first get started. The fourth position on my list is insurance agent. Now, when you first start your trucking business, you might see some outrageous quotes from some of these insurance companies. So it's going to be in your best interest to work with an insurance agent who will be able to shop your business around to multiple insurance companies to make sure you're getting the best rate. Now, the fifth position on my list is a safety and compliance manager. Because the trucking industry is so highly regulated by the federal government, it's important that you have a company on your side who understands those regulations and can help keep your company in good standing. Now a good compliance company should be able to manage your driver qualification files, your clearing house requirements and your drug consortium. Now, number six on the list, I hold near and dear to my heart. You got to have an accountant working on your trucking business. A good accountant is going to make sure you have good records on your income, your expenses, your assets, your liabilities, and your equity. They're also going to be able to make sure you stay out of a jam with the IRS. Now, the seventh position on my list is one that I hope you never need, but it's a lawyer. We live in a very litigious, lit litigious, liti whatever it is, just know people sue a lot and the trucking industry gets targeted a lot. If you ever drive through Indiana, you'll see a lot of billboards from that lawyer dude, the hammer because there are these law firms out here that work specifically against the trucking industry. It's in your best interest to make sure you have a lawyer on your side that can help you. If in case you ever find yourself in a precarious precarious, but if you ever find yourself in a bad spot, now last but not least on my list, you're going to want to make sure you have a good mechanic on your team. A good mechanic will be able to check out your truck before you buy it to make sure you're not purchasing a lemon. Breakdowns are just a part of the business, but a good mechanic is going to help minimize some of that downtime. Like they say, if the wheels ain't turning, you ain't earning. A good mechanic is going to play a key role in your trucking business. Now, one way to tell if you found a good mechanic is if they're using high quality products. Like Shell Rotella's T6 synthetic engine oil. The T6 has the triple protection plus technology which provides against wear, deposits, and oil breakdown. Compared to conventional engine oil, the T6 provides better fuel economy. To find out where you can buy Shero Teller's products, check out the link in the description below. Now, before I get out of here, I want to thank Shero Teller for rocking with me this year. And more importantly, I want to thank you, the viewers, for supporting the channel in a way that even makes these companies want to work with me. Like every comment, every like, every subscription, every video share, it means a lot to me because I know y'all don't really have to do that. So from the bottom of my heart, I really want to let y'all know that I appreciate y'all for supporting the channel. And if it wasn't for the support, you know, I wouldn't have been able to, you know, get these new glasses. Now, as far as the content of this specific video, um, before y'all ask me, you know, who I recommend for this service and that service, um, I have a list in the description of this video that you'll be able to download for free. 
and you'll see uh, all of the recommendations that I, that I have for these different positions that you'll want to fill in your trucking business. Now, if you found this video helpful or you have anything you want to add, then let me know in the comment section. Also, if you like this video, then please give it a thumbs up. And if you know anybody else out there who could benefit from this information, make sure you share this video with them. And as always, thanks again for watching.